Hello, Basham family, and welcome back to our YouTube channel. My name is Drew, if you're new here, and let's get this weekend vlog started. I'm at the Sonic. My weekend was supposed to be all home alone. I was going to do another solo weekend in the life like I did last weekend when Gabe was out of town. My order was coming. I had to pause real quick. But I was going to do another solo weekend in the life of a waffle. But I was getting ready uh, for the day and I filmed a video with my sister, which you guys will probably see before this vlog. And I was like, hmm, how can I surprise Gabe this weekend while he's out? And I was like, I can drive up tomorrow evening and surprise him at the end of the tournament. So at the end of the tournament, they weigh and like do all the fish and stuff like that. And I was like, I could totally like come at the last minute and like surprise him at the end. Well, as I'm talking with my sister on how I could do that, my husband calls me and he's like, get dressed. I'm on my way to pick you up like jokingly and I was like wait but no actually like do you want to pick me up because I would love to come and like watch you at the end and he was like okay so Gabe's on his way to come pick me up I just dropped off the dogs and I got me a little snack I got me a route 44 so I could put it in my stand that's not my drink give me a slushy hold on hold that thought I gotta reorder my drink because that's wrong but I hate doing this I hate complaining. I hate telling people I miss out. I'm nervy. Gabe always does this for me. Nervy. Anyways, I'm going to the lake and this is gonna be a fun weekend. I'm gonna vlog everything, vlog Gabe's tournament and stuff like that. Obviously, I can't film him on the boat because he'll be doing that, but I'm gonna film like all the other stuff and like what I do and all that. So it should be really fun. And yeah, um, but I was trying to show you my drink and it was wrong. So I'm gonna tell them that it was wrong. Anyways, I'm going to put you up right here. I also got me a small mozzarella stick. I haven't eaten all day. It's 3 o'clock. I'm starving. Mmm. These hit different. These are so good. But. And look who I'm with. What's up? We are on the way to where? Lake Sam Rayburn. Hey guys, so. Tomorrow, me and my buddy Dakota are fishing in a bass fishing tournament on Lake Sam Rayburn. We are fishing in a um, one of the uh, the Outlaw Skeeter tournaments. Um, it's supposed to be a pretty awesome tournament. I, if I had to guess, I think there's probably going to be around anywhere from like 70 to like 80, maybe 90 boats, I think. I don't know yet. When we got ours and when we registered, we were boat number 48. And most people registered the day before anyways. So if I had to guess, I would think there's probably closer to like 70 to 80 boats. Um, so it's gonna be a really cool tournament. Man, this morning I hooked into an 11.2 pounds. I'll insert a picture. Insert a picture, 11.2 pounds. And, I, and me and my buddy are like, yeah, this is my PB boat. I was like, man, if we'd have caught this tomorrow, it'd have been like- Game over. Game over, we, we would have won with that because we had some mondos today. We went, we pre-fished, we found some really good spots that we put on our, uh, on our, um, our GPS system so we know where to go and I uh, already have some pretty picked out spots kind of we kind of planned our day where we're gonna fish at what times and what we're gonna use so that's what we did today caught some big ones it was a blast and I'm excited to fish this tournament it's my first well I fished tournaments in high school but this is my first ever tournament not in high school and I'm super excited come on Robbie huh? buzz, bait. buzz bait here you go buddy boy buzz bait right there Alrighty guys, so me and Dakota, it is the night before the tournament. Uh, we are waking up at five in the morning. Right now we're making sure all of our fishing setups are ready to go for in the morning. So we ain't got to worry about nothing besides getting on the boat and catching fish. So it's my first tournament I've fished since like sophomore year of high school. It's been several years and it's hot. Guys. It's hot outside. It's like I you look kind of dead. It's so humid out here. It's dark outside and it's probably 100 degrees outside. We're fishing in East Texas desert. <laughs> it's it's ridiculous. We're hot, but you excited? We, oh, I'm I'm beyond excited. I'm what are you using? Excited. This one is a uh, a deep water uh, football jig. So we'll be throwing this one, you know, 15 foot of water plus 15 to 30 to 40 foot of water, right? 15 to 35. 15 to 35. So we'll be dragging that at the bottom, trying to catch bass that are hanging to the bottom when it gets hot. 
got some ledges that we're gonna fish. Thank you. We're not giving away y'all secrets. The bass are staging right off the ledge, and that that football jig will come off, and it'll be perfect. Here. And then this honky right here. You're done. All right, guys, and then this beauty right here is what I caught the 11.2 pounder on this morning. This uh, spinner bait right here, they call it the firecracker. This spinner bait is done by, um, what is it? Got another one right here, bought another one, War Eagle. By War Eagle Lures, half ounce, or not half ounce, quarter ounce. Check that out. So, this little beauty right here, we got rigged up. We got the, uh, well, dad, gum it. Right here, we've got the, uh, this is a bandito bug, Texas rig. We're going to be flipping around some cypress trees and stuff. So that's going to come in handy for that. All right, guys. And then Dakota has already got a ribbit frog on. So I'm going to pull this ribbit frog off. This ribbit frig. I'm going to pull this ribbit frog off. Frog off. The ribbit frog off. I'm probably going to pull this ribbit frog off. And I'm going to throw on a, um, this with this braid. I'm probably going to throw a grass jig on. Throw it into the grass and whip it through the grass. So... That's probably the next move on this rod. This is so funny. That was not my <laughs> fault. That was your fault. I got a bait. You got a fish. <laughs> Dude, when you prank me today, like you got that tin powder? That was funny. After that prank girl. All right, baby, I love you. I love you. Hey, keep your phone on. I'm gonna let you know if I get a fucking bag in the boat. I'm gonna call you and I'm gonna let you know. Hey, yo. We ain't leaving, dog. Love you, baby girl. Love you. Hey, that's your money, dude. <laughs> Good morning, morning, Michael. Uh, I'll, I'll play around. Wait, say what I'm supposed to say? Good morning, friends. Hello, singing kitty friends. So, what are we doing today? So, today we're going to be going to the beach. And where's Gabe and Dakota? Well, Gabe and Dakota are fishing a tournament right now for a lot of moolah. So, that's Jordan. That's Fisher, that's true, that's Michael. And um, we're about to go to the beach. Girl that can do both. I can't do both. Very impressive. I don't care. Is it going? Yeah. Is it? No. Yeah, it's going. Get a bonk. Okay. Number six. Okay, to see the boys. Hopefully, they got the third fish. He caught a freaking nine. We were like, dude, nine. He caught an eleven. We were like, we're freaking. Huh? No. We got two fish in the first seven minutes, and the rest of the tournament, nothing. <gasps> She said, y'all didn't get three fish? I said, no, we got two in the first seven minutes. Yeah. That's like, it wasn't terrible. Show the fish. You have to be in mind like crazy. Everybody hurry up. Yesterday, it was on, huh? Yesterday, Yesterday dude. Yesterday, they were catching on like crazy. Yesterday, it was done. Shallow. 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 Pure kids. Next to the water. Yeah, freaking slamming. Dude, shallow. Like, back, to back, to back, to back, to back. It's all part of it. Like, did you? We like to put a cute little girls on. Hey, guys. We fished too good during the pre-fish. We caught all the big ones in the pre-fish. So today, nothing. nothing. Let's make Jordan more nervous and let's video it. <laughs> We're trying to back it. I'm just here for moral support. You did it. Thanks again. 
Oh, we did it! We did it! We did it! Yeah. <laughs> Where are the boys at? We did it! We did right it! There. We did it! Yay! We. Hit. Oh, that's what we're doing. He had to get the boat so he could clip it and pull to the princess. <laughs> How do y'all feel? Guys, look, it's guys, hot as hell. <laughs> it is hot, but also I gotta say something. What? Don't let your emotions get the best of you. That's we learned that in kindergarten. Yeah, but I, I just went back to kindergarten. Hey. Dixie so, came out the window. Hey, get her. 11 pounds. 11 pounds to get a check today, which would have been, I think, bottom 700 bucks. 700, uh, you'd have got 11 or higher, you got 700 bucks. Guys, we'd have had like five and a half pounds. It's okay, there's always next weekend. Hey, yesterday, we were on them. Today, we weren't. Next weekend, we're gonna be on them, hopefully. And if we're not, we have fun. We're gonna try. We're gonna try. It's time to stink and eat. Guys, if you can tell, I'm burnt. Ah, leak. But here we are, we're in the truck right here. Got Big Mike back there. We are heading home. Drew is driving. I'm driving the truck. Drew's driving the truck. It's I a big old truck. It's a big truck. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm hot. My face hurts. As you can tell, I should have wore sunscreen and I did not. Put me a little good sunglass tan, you know. But we're heading home. My sweet baby's driving. It was a great tournament. Um, didn't do so great, but we had a great time. And we're heading home and we'll show you guys where we stop on the way. Well, Gabe is getting gas, and I'm gonna try this. I've never seen these. It's a bubble gum, bubblelicious cotton candy flavored ghost. So I'm really excited about this. I'm gonna need me a little bit of energy. I don't have any coffee today. Ooh. That is like bubble gum. That is so good. Love. What's up, baby? Love you. You are so red. Try I this. know. I'm wearing a tomato. Try this. Is your face burnt right there on your cheek? It hurts. You're probably gonna get a blister right there. My what did we hurts. learn today? Wear sunscreen. Okay. So, y'all, Gabe thinks he's gonna grow his hair out and do a little flow. Let's see. Yeah, got a little bit going on. Oh my gosh! Here, try this. It's the cotton candy bubble gum. It's really good. Cotton candy bubble gum. Mhm. Mm I made sure to spray down Michael today, but you didn't wear any. That's good. Wow. That's good, huh? That one's delicious. I like it a lot. It didn't have like that weird it fake cotton want, candy flavor. That one's better. No, it makes you want to chew. Like there's bubble gum in your mouth. It's got like a berry bubble gummy kind of. That is money right there. That's money, dude. That's money, dude. <laughs> you got a sandwich. You got a sandwich. You got a burger. No, Michael's burger. Look how much cool quip they put on there. <laughs> and that cool quip.